You're processing like we are, what you saw today. Our Liliana Pearson spoke to a man, tells us he called 911 after watching Sky 3 fall from the sky today. Liliana? Yeah, Jamie, right now I'm in a neighborhood in Montclair South where I met a man named David Bristol. He tells me that he was in his home here in this neighborhood when anytime he hears an aircraft go overhead, he likes to go out onto his back porch and take a look at it because he's a pilot in training himself. He tells me that he went outside, he looked up, saw Sky 3, he recognized it doing big circles out in the community as oftentimes we see it doing. He says, but there were a couple things the longer that he watched it that he started to notice. First, he says that rhythmic sound that a helicopter typically makes, he noticed it changed a couple times and then it made a couple really sharp turns to the left hard enough that he thought it seemed unusual and that's when he saw it fall out of the sky he says he immediately called 911 and he says that he heard what he assumes is the impact when it hit the ground David recently experienced loss himself he tells us that he felt this gut-wrenching reaction when he realized what the outcome of this crash most likely was going to be for me personally, I had tragedy this past week uh, with my father passing away, and um, it was a bit of, oh no, here it goes again. Because I, I knew that just um, that roll, that sharp roll to the left and a very rapid descent, it didn't look survivable. Uh, and whether you were a witness to this or you're learning about all this information right here with us, it's definitely a wave of emotions. And tonight at 11, we will be hearing from somebody who tells us he saw the crash site firsthand. I'm Liliana Pearson, WBTV, on your side. Liliana, a lot of us here learning about what has happened today as everybody watching TV right now is learning. We are all sort of going through this together. Liliana, thank you. And, and tell David, that nice gentleman, for, for speaking with us. Because even hearing what it sounded like and some noises, that can help the investigation mm -hmm. as to what really happened here. At 7.30, the Panthers and Charlotte FC began its annual Christmas tree